Yo, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're talking about Alonzo Metafield versus Colos Olberg. Alonzo Metafield 15 and 3, 15, 3 and 1. Olberg's 9 and 1. Metafield 4 0 and 1 in his last five fights, plus 170 underdog, 36 years old, 6 foot tall with a 76 inch reach. Olberg 9 and 1, 210 favorite, 33 years old, 6'4 with a 77 inch reach, 4 inches taller, but a 1 inch reach advantage. The biggest thing is, can Menafield's big power land on Allberg? I would typically say no, but Allberg didn't look good in his last one seven months ago against Daon Jung. Didn't look good. I know he got a finish at, in the, later in the fight. Still didn't look good. You know, oops, let's go back to that. My bad. Um, you know, Menafield being 15 and 3 has. What, 13 finishes, been finished the one time by OSP, 8-3-1 and one in the UFC, 6 finishes total. I like what he's been able to do. Besides the William Knight fight, he's won 1, 2, 3, 4, you know, 5, 6, 6 in a row. Because the William Knight fight, neither one of those guys really did a whole lot of things. A whole lot of fighting at all. I, I like Metafield. I like his power. I like his ability to find the shot. Um, I think he needs to close the distance and figure out the long, linky striking of Olberg. But olberg has been touched a little bit in his last couple of matchups, especially in his last one. Didn't look good at all. Ior Potiera, he beat Nikolai. He beat Tefan. He beat, even though Tefan shouldn't be in, been in there. Just hasn't fought a lot of good guys. And I like, I like, uh, Manafield, I think he can get the job done. I think it might be a bit of a shocker as well. Alonzo Manafield, your winner. As always, subscribe, like, comment. Peace.